Let's go. Let's go. All right. Welcome to the podcast. It's a special one. Yo, yo, yo. <laughs> Where's Guam podcast special guest in the house? What's that? Jeff Cobb, Olympian, professional wrestler, and our homie. Alumni. Class of 2000. Yeah, yeah. 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 <laughs> Class okay, of 2000. Dude, how's this though? Freaking Y2K, right? It's like a You're crazy killed. thing. <laughs> Something's going to happen. The world's going to end, right? And then our reunion, the 2020, COVID. So I tell you, that's what, that's it, what it is. Dude, we're fucking... Y, Y2K was 20 years too late. <laughs> yeah, dude. <laughs> fucking, where's... Dude, that was a crazy one. But how you been? We haven't seen you for a long time. I know. Thank goodness for social media. Mm-hmm. <laughs> like social media, I kind of just like keep track of what's going on in the world. Yeah. And classmates and stuff. And Fuck yeah, that's cool, man. Damn. Have a regular classmates fucking professional Japan Let's champion. Love. Former, former champion. Well, former cha- two-time champion, I think. Yes. And we're going to play a clip for it of you, maybe some of your highlights. So Yeah. Paradigm shift. Oh! oh wow. Running uppercut just dropped John Moxley in the corner. If Follows you, through with you, that. If you notice that Cobb rarely misses. He doesn't have a lot of offensive mistakes. Well, That's, JR, he was yeah. also focusing on Moxley's blind side. Moxley couldn't see him coming. Yeah. Well, the point you made earlier, Jerry, about the peripheral vision that he cannot see Pulls that right side, Mox, and Cobb taking advantage of it. Now what? Oh, look at that. Yeah, Frank. Whoa. Hell yeah. Just YouTube it and then add it to this. And the, um, whatever you want to do. Tour of the Islands. Yeah. Did you make that up or someone had that already? Or? No, one of my one of my friends who is a uh, Samoan, uh, he, he did it and I thought, oh, that's pretty cool. But I could do it to guys that are bigger. Fuck. And then. That's what you I said? Stole, yeah. I was like, dude, I stole it from him, man. He ain't, gonna do, he ain't gonna do nothing about it. <laughs> so, yeah. Sets him up. Gilbert. Toward the island. Oh. Toward the island. Toward yeah. the island. Tour of the islands. That's it. Copy. Should be. Ring the bell. Yeah. Dude, do you you didn't see that move? I'll show no. you the video, bro. It's fucking crazy. Like they jump sideways on him and he catches them and then he fucking goes like this and then before he like drops them, he spins them the other way and wham! <laughs> I'm like, dude, that guy's back is strong. Yeah. It's called Tour of the Islands. He's like, I bring you to the islands and I say, Mm-mm. go back. Boom. Yeah. Dude, I'll show you the video. It's fucking crazy. Or bro. Much like, get off my island. Yeah, yeah. Damn. Get off my it's island. It's a parcel. Yep. It's fun. Yeah. <laughs> Fucking Dude, it's Jeff. Good to hear. I was like, oh, can I tell them how I saw this one time? Oh, yeah. Sure. Yeah. You know, Facebook. So Facebook friends, seeing oh, yeah. all your stuff. And then one day I saw you post something like a link. And I was like, what is this link? Because I clicked on it. <laughs> and I was like, oh, so it's like Stu and Amir. I was like, what's going on over here? <laughs> so I just like sat there, watched it. And I was like, oh, dude, this is pretty cool. And I watched like, ooh. Damn. Damn, bro. Keep on rolling. We don't How cut did here. The bottom fall out. Did you see that? Till the roofs fall off. <laughs> 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 oh, <laughs> damn, were you jamming hey, that jam? You guys keep on going. <laughs> keep, keep the show going. Oh. Damn. Anyway, so I saw Stu and Amir's stuff, and I was like, "Oh, this is pretty cool." And I sat there and watched like two or three episodes. <laughs> that was fucking crazy. And then, yeah, I was just like pretty much. Next time I come to Guam, I want to do it. I want to do their podcast. Nice. And yeah. lo and behold. 
He's here. 2022. Wow. I am here with Amir and Stu. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's my rap for today. Hell yeah. I like that one, man. I can rap. Hell uh, yeah. Where'd Stu go? Oh, yeah. I had to replace his cup freaking fell. So, yeah. So, I'm drinking a, a modified Coke and uh, drinking a... I'm uh, uh, doing... I don't know. Do we get... You guys say what it is? Or no, it's like free advertising, right? Yeah, I okay. Guess. Uh, Jack Daniels, single barrel select. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Forty-seven yeah. percent alcohol. Not bad. What do you prefer, though? Like, what's your prefer uh, whiskey? Uh, there is one that I just started. It's a McKellen. Oh, that's yours. Oh no, that's mine. McKellen? Yeah. Is that, uh... It's a. It's a nice. It's a nice whiskey. It's so smooth. Although. Um, Probably my favorite is Johnny Walker Blue Label. It's a little pricey, but it's Ooh. yeah, it's it's yeah, it's, you, it's the tits, man. It's the tits. I'm, yeah. So that's I'm gonna try. We're gonna try it out on the next one. Yeah. You, oh, you know what? If I can, when next time I come back, can I come back on the podcast? Hell yeah! Okay. Right. I'll bring. I'll bring that. I'll bring that one. <laughs> I'll bring that I, I didn't see one. Oh, that's good. I thought it was. Oh, it was shit, gonna be like you know how like friends. Oh um, man. Yeah, that you meet up and you haven't talked to for a long time and it's like fucking back to normal like we were back in school. Yeah. It's like fucking crazy, right? Yeah. I feel like I, I missed the bus to go to school. Huh? I, I feel like I, I just missed the bus to go to school. I'm late for my first period. Yep. <laughs> Dude, we used to fucking... We used to skate back in the day. You rode the bus to school? I tried to, tried to skate. You rode to school? Yeah. Because I live over by... on. Kaiser, right? Song, song or Ising Song, whatever yeah. you want to call it. And I used to catch the bus right there in the corner uh, where Maria E. Joe is. Cop that bus. Didn't really know anybody on that on that bus though. It's kind of sad. <laughs> no way. <laughs> You're a fucking Beast. wrestling fucking super phenom from Guam. We're so proud every time we see when we see what like the freaking this guy got some action figure part. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah! I saw you posted it. Yeah, that was a, lot, a while ago too. And this, you still have the merch, uh, chosen one. Uh, chosen few. Nah, or chosen that, few? One, that, that was my buddy's company. Mm. He sponsored us. Uh, who sponsored me for a little bit, but then like he stopped. He got too busy with uh, like three kids and so yeah. got too busy with that. Uh, so that kind of went away. But now uh, sponsored by this company, Suplex out of the you. UK. Damn! Uh, great company. And so if you're, you know, I'll send you a link so you can post it to this video. Hell yeah. We'll or SPLX, SPLXWrestling.com. We'll have the link up. Hell yeah. 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 <laughs> okay. Oh, did you guys already choose the... Oh, no, yeah, oh, dude, we're it. a little bit late on it, but how we start the show, but Cheers. we're doing it now. Cheers. Cheers to you yeah. guys. Thanks for watching. Where's Guam Podcast? Episode, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> what is it? Special guest. The special guest in the house. Do I get, house. This is a good uh, podcast name. Because like I went to college in Missouri, and people yeah. were like, oh, where's from? Guam? I was like, well, yep. I was born in Hawaii, but you know, my mom's side's from Guam. I was like, oh, where's Guam? Exactly. Like, yep. On. And I was like, it's in the Pacific, man. Like It's kind of like near Japan and Hawaii, like somewhere in the center. They're like, really? I never heard of it. I was like, it's cool, man. I remember when I was in Seattle, they... They fucking asked me like, "Do you guys got houses over there?" Like they thought we were in the fucking huts and shit, dude. I'm like, "What? It's a U.S. territory." Yeah, but they have no idea. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what you gotta always educate them. I just get tired of telling the same story over and over. And over. Yep. Like, Bro, just be diverse. Learn, learn about other things, man. When you landed on Guam, were you like, "Oh shit, back home"? Dude, it was cool. Guam's like, always special for you. Yeah, like I haven't been here since before the pandemic. So yeah. 2019 was the last time I came. And like, Ooh. I was like, man, it's been three years. So when I got off the airport, I was like, mom, I'm here. It's like, I'm coming. And I was like, all right, I'll wait outside. Bad choice. I was waiting outside. You're sweating. Sweat. Yeah. Oh my God. Yeah. I forgot how hot it was yeah. in Guam, bro. I was like, Woo! Dude, just sometimes just when you take a shower, Oh, and then you get out, as soon as I got sweaty. Well, as soon as I got home, I was like, I gotta jump in the shower. I'm yep. a little sticky. But yep. yeah, man. Oh, I have. I mean, man, I love Guam, but how that's cold one is it thing in I don't Japan? Miss. Uh, it's about the same. Like honestly, like it's the heat's about the same, the humidity's about the same. So it's kind of like being in Guam, but with shorter people. So. <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> no, I love Japan though. Japan's cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fucking, cha we have a homie that's a champion, bro. Oh, that's yeah. like a. So you're wrestling out in Japan right now? Mm -hmm. oh, yeah. So my main contract is with a company called New Japan Pro Wrestling. 
they're technically the second biggest in the world. Obviously, WWE mm. is the number one because they got that billion dollar streaming deal with um, with USA Network and and Fox. So they, they got all the money in the world, but you know, money doesn't buy you happiness. Yeah, yeah, dude. There's you told you page. A lot. <laughs> <It's okay. laughs> told you page. <laughs> This guy, one time we were just randomly talking, and he's like, Paige Van Zandt, what's up? <laughs> and I was like, you think she's going to see this podcast? I'm like, fuck yeah, she'll see know, this. She might. Like, what's up, She Paige? works for a company that I wrestle for, too, something. So, oh, yeah? Yeah. <laughs> it's on TNT, TBS. Fucking Paige Van Zandt. I don't think you she's going to You ever met her? Play. Yeah. You did? Damn. So you, you met those uh, alpha alpha male guys? Yeah. Uh, yeah. yeah. I mean, they're... I mean, it's a small world, like especially like wrestling. There's like a lot of former UFC fighters. After they leave, like fighting, they do pro wrestling. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So like uh, Matt Riddle, uh, he was like five and zero undefeated, and then he got fired from the UFC because he tested positive for weed. Yeah. <laughs> then he left, and now he's in WWE. Uh, Tom Lawler trained with him jujitsu. Bob but, oh, Uriah, he met Uriah. Met Uriah in Sacramento. Dude, so is uh, it true? One, of, one of the kids that I one of the kids I coached in high school was his wrestling coach. So it was pretty cool. Got to meet him because of that. And yeah, it's just like a small oh, world. Dude, you've like, been around. Damn. Yeah. It's fun though. Like it's cool. Like Josh Barnett's a wrestler. Yeah. Wrestled him twice. Damn. Beat me up and hit me in a heel hook or whatever it's called. I don't know. Some bullshit. Don't quote me on that, Josh. But <laughs> he's like what six two, right? Yeah, he's a big boy. He's a big boy. He's cool though, man. Like he's he's a good dude. Did you suplex? He just him? yeah, I did. Oh damn! But then, <laughs> but then he also then like I said, he put me in an arm bar and heel hook and it's not fun, man. But when you got your chat, you're like fuck it, boo! Yeah, I got him. I'm gonna drop you on your head, boy. Dude, but uh, wrestlers, I feel like for the uh, UFC, we just started Jeff K, right? Hmm? You started wrestling in Jeff K. Yeah. Yeah, and he's an, he's he's also an Olympian, guys. Former, former, former. two thousand four, right? Yeah, he, he back in the day, made it in the circles when I was when I was young, when we were young. <laughs> that was what in Australia, uh, Here, Athens, Athens, Greece. Damn, hmm. see, fuck, yeah, dude, that's badass. Jeff Cobb in the house. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hi, oh, guys. Uh, shout out to Herman, um, Julius. Uh, who else is was over there? I don't know. Jeff, what's up, guys? Because they, I, you remember those guys, right? Yeah. Jeff? yeah. Wait, they were like, the, yeah, Hermie Oh, hey. They what's were up? like, uh, at the I saw them at a barbecue like a couple days ago, uh-huh. and they're like, hey, say what's up to us on the podcast. I was like, fuck, you guys watch it? Okay, oh. we'll say what's up. Wait, so look, can I say what's up to? Yeah. This? yeah. What's up, Herman? Jeff. He, Jeff. Jeff and uh. Fuck, I forgot that then. Alonzo. No. Alonzo, uh, Alonzo what's up, man? <laughs> what's his name? Julius. Julius. Season? No, Julius. Uh, uh, damn. Man, I forget last name. Yeah. Really. <laughs> you guys drinking over there. Yeah, Julius, <laughs> Julius Caesar. Julius <laughs> Caesar. He died like 500 years ago. What is his last name? But Julius. Yeah, sorry. Bermudis. Bermudis. Oh, yeah. okay, okay. Yeah. I feel, like we up, gotta, I feel like we got to bust out a yearbook. Dude, we do. I don't have mine anymore. Yeah, I have one in the yeah, house. I do. Yeah, I do. Damn. Well, I only oh, have sad. like I only have from my junior and senior year. Yeah, I had sad. one freshman year, but senior, I lost it. I don't it. know where my own's at. I'm. I can't. I want to find my freshman year one because there's some man. Like my, I don't know about you guys, but like my first year JFP, I was like, oh man, look at all these chicks, yeah. <laughs> these older girls, and I kind of want to like. Because of social media, you kind of want to stalk them a little bit. <laughs> and you'd be like, what you, what you What's the name, Ray? Right? Fucking. Well, I mean, I don't want to say it on here because I don't want to yeah, get yeah, in trouble. Yeah, yeah, no, no, no. Way yeah. off camera. But. Yeah. <laughs> but, yeah. Jeff, Jeff's got training and not uh, saying the fucked up shit. Or yeah. the shit that you that's going to get you in trouble yeah. somewhere, right? Especially the social media. Like, yeah. Nowadays, they'll, like, they'll cut you up. Yeah, man. Like the <laughs> Me Too and all that mm-hmm. stuff. That's crazy, man. But mm-hmm. hey, one, one small step. Johnny Depp. Wow. Yeah, <laughs> Johnny got it right. Hell yeah! Fuck wow. that guy. The first man to win an argument. Right? Yeah, that's, <laughs> that was the meme I saw. Yeah, yeah. I was, uh, I was like, you guys watch that stuff? You guys watch? I, it? I, I, I heard and watched some of it. Like she fucking shit in his bed. And yeah, I see. I I only watched like little clips. I never yeah. sat there and watched. The no, movie. yeah, I, j- I just see the clips. Yeah, TikTok but it's so funny shit. though. Man. Yeah, like the. Like my dog stepped on yeah. the <laughs> Yeah. 
<laughs> even with a lawyer like called her out like so you're lying then no i'm not like what the fuck that means you're lying yeah that means you're She's lying like, oh my goodness know. like fuck this when they said the verdict the whole world all the guys got a little bit quiet and then like, yeah! <laughs> dude, they're playing the Humpty Fucking Dance song. So, dude, <laughs> <laughs> Johnny Depp, though. Dude, baby. Dude, Humpty Dumpty. But the thing is, though, like, the now, now, now that he's, he is, I mean, I don't know, was he, he was cleared, right? Or whatever. Like, Amber he paid was. her some, the settlement was like two million that uh, Depp pays her, and, but um she owes him like 15 million okay. or something like that <laughs> that's crazy right that's yeah. like fi- just 15 million mm-hmm. so he won cool. he won 13 million because they just yeah yeah just cancel each other out yeah it must be nice yeah fucking like, johnny depp 13 million can i borrow <laughs> <laughs> hey he's let just, me borrow i just saw you won he's just smiling just thousand johnny just a johnny depp skis oh man oh man yeah, isn't, so, he, isn't he sponsored by like a cologne, right or something? I don't know. He probably well, like a lot of people, cologne. a lot of people dropped him though. Yeah. Like the sponsorship, but there's like one or two that stuck with him, and the ones that stuck with him, I'm gonna buy your products. I don't even know what it is, but <laughs> I'm I saw find one out. that was like, uh, like now they're excited to offer Johnny more money for for another uh, Pirates. Yeah. Oh, he better get that money. Like multi million. Yeah, because he, he got dropped. Yeah. And they, but then the see you get they acted like too quick without seeing yeah, 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 everything yeah, yeah. yeah. And but like, sometimes it could just be over like a fucking a, a tweet or a fucking yeah. clip and like somehow it just fucking goes viral and they're like check this guy out yeah. <laughs> I don't know I feel like we got a little too sensitive with everything I mean shoot back in the days you'd say stupid things to each other there was yeah. no, there was, yeah. no uh, there was no, there was no evidence. Yeah, right. Because you know, there's one time in DJ clubs, <laughs> Stu called me something that I'm not gonna repeat. But you know, it's whatever. DJ club. What did I call you? I don't even remember. I know exactly. I'm not gonna say it. I don't want you to get canceled. <laughs> Dude, we always. But Mr. Spina knows. He knows, <laughs> he knows what he said. Dude, Mr. Speed. I'm trying to get into DJ clubs. This guy told me there's no there's no more space. <laughs> That's fucked up, Rick. He's like, hey, I want to join. I'm like, can't join. There's it's full. You couldn't my I didn't do any DJ stuff. I just carried stuff. And then I was like, okay. Whatever oh. happened to that guy, Chris? The white guy that was in that class. You remember that guy? In middle school there was a yeah. guy named Chris, a white boy. The white boy. I don't know. But anyway. Yeah, see, this is why we need yearbooks. Yeah. That's what you need. Like, next time you have a, a fellow alumni, you have to have the... You have your yearbook still? No. Yeah. You do? No, April has her yearbook. Yeah, we... High school so we or do. DMS? Yeah, I gotta look no, at that. Oh, I don't know about DMS, but I know high school. Dude, I kind of want a DMS yearbook. <laughs> Fuck you, DMS. Yeah, I want the first mine, man. Dude, my sixth, my sixth grade yearbook was dope. I want, I want to get that. I can't find that, though. But I kind of want to go to DMS. Dude, you open that, you're going to fucking relive, like, Young Crush. Like, damn, this is when this chick <laughs> likes me, yeah, dude. But then that's, that's when you get, that's when you, that's when you get social fucking media. play Atlantic Star, right? <laughs> <laughs> but that's why you have. Like, damn, Atlantic Star. Was, was it Atlantic Star, Janet, back then? Yep. So that's a fucking love yeah. Steve. But that's, but that's the thing, though. It's like, you got that. And then you got social media. You kind of search a little bit. Yeah. Like, how's this person doing? Bump Angel Ooh, Beach. <laughs> Dude. Damn, nah. What, like, that's how long, do you uh, recover after like working out or a match? Do you go like uh, in that ice bath? Or well, because like we have like cool hotels, so we just always just if you're really sore, kind of just get like ice and then just sit in an ice bath. Mm. In your in your hotel? Room? Yeah. Oh damn. I think it helps, but I don't know. How long do you stay in it for? Like, 10, 15 minutes. Yeah. Fuck you, dude. I forgot who, which UFC fighter was doing that. The Polish Hammer, like, but he go, he, they, him and his buddies drive to the, like the closest lake or something. Oh, they start shit, cracking yeah. it, yeah, and no, then bro. then they jump in. I'm like, what if everything cracks? But, yeah, you know they're, they're just you're screwed. They're just fucking swimming it out. A Polish guy. No, that's you're screwed after that. Like if you go under and like, oh, yeah, I've seen too many movies like that. Mm-hmm. <laughs> that's why the, the regular people were like. That guy's crazy. <laughs> yeah. Fuck yeah. 
Well, I started doing something in in Vegas, the the cryo chambers. Yeah, it's only, the only three machine? minutes. No, it's just it's like a it's a circle like CO two or something. Oh, or, okay. You're in a circle, yeah, like around your whole body. Yeah, they just close it. That you wear gloves and socks because those will f- freeze first. And then you're in there three minutes, and it gets to like negative. It's like three hundred. You tried that oh. out? Yeah. How does that? Or, th- or a hundred something. How does that Did it help? Out. Yeah, dude, it's great. Like three minutes, but you're just like kind of like just shaking. But then yeah. after three minutes, dude, you feel you feel good, man. Dude, are you ready How much to go? Is that though? That's like like thirty bucks a session or something. Oh, that's 30, good. 40 bucks. But it's like for three minutes. Yeah. It's crazy. But then it fucking like you just feel you're good. rejuvenated. Yeah, you feel good. Like there, I've, I've been in there like after like a long weekend or some like wrestling. I feel I feel great, man. In Vegas. Do you know how many yeah. matches you've had total? Yeah, um, nine hundred. Oh shit. Eighty something. What? Any concussions when you had any of those? I'm pretty sure I did. <laughs> Fuck but, you, dude. But you never check. Yeah, it's never another never anything like super bad where I forget stuff or yeah. But, like, I know I've been, like... Th- so, I didn't even know this, like... Apparently, like, any time you've ever been, like, whoa, like, yeah. you've got a concussion. I never knew that. Or anything you see, like, a flash or... Yeah, yeah, Because like, there have been times, like, you know, JFK or whatever, like, playing basketball or yeah. something. Yeah, catch yeah. an elbow. Yeah, bro, like, there's oh, been times okay, where I was, like, whoa. Dude, oh, they oh, would oh. always try to take you out when we were playing ba- basketball, <laughs> whoever pushed you up or whatever. Yeah, but- so that right there, like... Anytime that's ever happened, that's technically a concussion. Like, Remember we played racquetball in PE? Bro, racquetball is dangerous. Is that like Mr. Luhan? Yes, no. I told you, dude. It's dangerous, dude. Dude, Mr. Luhan used to go ham, dude. He was like, he'd be playing and then he'd come up with an enemy in and that. Bam! Hey, didn't you get him? Yeah, bro. And then you got bad sport. <laughs> yeah. Fuck. I don't think he's still teaching, though. But Fuck you. He got him. The ball hit him. He got him. <laughs> I wasn't trying to hit him. I was just trying to win. Dude, I kept laughing when I felt bad, dude. I was like, fuck. Dude, we had the basketball team. <laughs> dude, this guy freaking would always surprise guys because oh, you're a wrestler, but you played basketball, but they didn't know how much you played. And dude. then he fucking would, he would block like two guys in a row. <laughs> dude. <laughs> and they're like, what the fuck? Oh, days. Yeah. Fuck, I missed those days. You, tri- you would trip them out when you fucking block them out and you fucking run it down. Fucking, I remember those days. It's a good days when I was young. So, what's next on the, when's your next um, show or? Uh, uh, June 12th. Is that something like people can watch or do yeah. they like buy something? Uh, June 12th, uh, njpwworld.com. Uh, it's our streaming service in Japan. It's uh, 999 yen per month, which comes out to like 850. Oh, okay. Yeah. You can watch uh, a month's worth of stuff, or if you just want to watch one and cancel, please don't don't cancel. It's <laughs> worth it. But yeah, so that's uh, one of our bigger shows for the summer. Uh, and then after that, I go back to the states for a couple shows. Then I come back to Japan. Yeah. How so many? You, are going. You're gonna relocate to the states again? No, uh, I just get sent to the states for oh, like, okay. like maybe like two weeks at a time. Oh, okay. Yeah. Uh, yeah. This last time I was there for like. May, like all of May. So, let's say I had like a month off. Nice. It's so, fun. Fucking Jeff's been around everywhere. This guy's seen, like, you've seen some crazy shit. Oh, yeah. yeah. Parties and, like, you've seen crazy shit. Yeah, right? man. Been, I've been very fortunate and very blessed, man. Like, yeah. there's, been, there's been times, like, I do a show in Germany, but they flew us into Amsterdam. They in and out of Amsterdam. <clears throat> so, we fly into Amsterdam, drive to Germany to do a show. Come back to Amsterdam, and then I fly out the next morning out of Amsterdam. So like we have the night in Amsterdam. It's everything you've heard of Amsterdam is no true. No way. It's true, bro. Dude. It's crazy. Those like, are one of the spots you always think like, I would like to check that place out. It's crazy though. Like I, you know, just from a little islander boy, get yeah. thrown into that world. Like the red light district is real. <laughs> it is no joke. You know Tim uh, Rosborst? Yeah. So he was wrestling too before, right? Or no, he was track and field. Oh, okay. Yeah, but he, he that's went, a throwback he, name. Yeah, yeah, Tim, the big yeah. guy. Yeah. I he was doing Him and his brother were really good for Guam. Uh, Tim and uh, his brother John, they both were. I think they went to like San Diego State or San Diego, like a college. So he, he wasn't wrestling too. No, no, no. Gosh, I thought he wrestled. Just... I think he did for like one year, but then like he started getting really into track, and he's really good. 
Dang. But he went to Sanchez, though, so we don't care. Fuck that. <laughs> Dude. <laughs> I that's know. funny how you said no, that. I, was fucking, just I still feel like that rivalry. Like so, would it fucking? Girls, go we, to all a went party to D- we, we all went to DMS. Yeah. We all went to DMS, though. Yeah, but then all of a sudden, I didn't even know. I thought everybody just went from DMS to JFK. No, but I didn't realize. Oh, some of the guys are gonna go to Sanchez. Yeah. Some are gonna go to JFK, which is totally fine. Like, I mean, we had friends from DMS that went to Sanchez, which is cool. But you know, just, I feel JFK was better. Yeah. yeah. No, it was it was better. Dude, I think <laughs> it was right, better. I, right now, I heard so far that Jeff K this year had like the most uh, funnest graduation. Real? Yeah. yeah. Man. Oh, shout out to JFK class of 2022. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Damn, 2022. Was Everybody else, I don't really care about. Yeah. <laughs> JFK though. Yeah. Hey, dude, this way. is like a like a mini reunion right now. Yeah. Man. So cheers, guys. Yeah. Ah. Mini reunion. Hell yeah, yeah. Cheers to you guys too. Ah. Some of the Thanks for fucking messaging me. This guy, just out of the blue, I'm, for me, I was like, he's like, hey, can I be on your podcast? But I'm like, man, we're fucking honored. Shit. Right? Hell I was yeah. like, you fucking hell yeah. Cause we I, didn't, I didn't realize that like, you're so busy, though. Because, like, I mean, you, we're, you know, you got your you got your business up and running. And I was like, uh, hey, Stu, bro, let me be on your, like, can yeah. I be on your podcast? <laughs> no answer. Yeah. Like, oh, oh, yeah. Man. Sorry about that. Amir. Yeah. Hey, man, I hit him, Stu. <laughs> This guy's calling me. Yes, it's true, though. I was busy, man. Hey, no, I ain't. Yeah. Hey, but I'm not here, though. Hey, you say, better hey. refill that drink. Know, Give him some ice. Get, yeah. like a, get that man some so, ice. So you're busy being a monkey, dude. That's stupid. Hey, no, but this guy. So, Matt Barnett is your homie. Josh Barnett. Josh. Josh. Or Josh Barnett, sorry. Yeah. Is there any other, um, like, MMA guys that you, like, are buddies with or came across? Yeah. Uh, Josh Barnett, Matt Riddle. Uh, Matt Tom Lawler, um, there's a few of them. Yeah, like well, those are just the ones that I I, I see a lot, a lot because of their pro wrestlers now. Um, I'd assume they make more money. I don't know. It's weird. Yeah. <laughs> but, Wait, this guy's got a. So you just signed a three year contract, is what you said? Yeah. So um, originally I was just doing like year uh, year contracts with my company, New Japan, um, and then last summer. Uh, okay. no, this is good enough. We don't, you don't need coke. Yeah. But thank you. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> I appreciate that. But um, yeah, then this past 2021 summer, I was very fortunate enough to turn down a WWE contract. Ooh. You because, turned it down? Yeah, because I wanted to stay in Japan. Uh, and then January rolled. This past January, I did a. Th- I signed a three-year deal with them. So I'll be there. I'll be in Japan for three years. You like know? living there, dude? It's great, it? man. What's your favorite things to do over there? When you're um. Out? Well, if if you follow my Instagram page, you'll see a lot of like random nature pictures. Just because, man, Japan's so beautiful. Yeah. And I, you know, like when I was traveling a lot before, before I had this contract, like I would go to like three different states every weekend for like two, three years in a row. Fuck. Damn. But I was like, yeah. I was like, you, I didn't. That's I didn't, what you were doing. Yeah, but I didn't. <laughs> but I didn't get a chance to enjoy it because yeah. like, like I would fly in and then I'd have like two hours before I had to be at the show. Yeah. So I'd you know get food and, or take a nap or whatever at the yeah, hotel. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's and then crazy go to the show, schedule, bro. Come back to the hotel like one o'clock in the morning, shower, try to repack, and then Man, fly you live six a.m. Fucking yeah, but I never got busy to, like, life. I never got to like take advantage of like you know when you were in the town. Yeah, so cities. like I'd be like in like I'd be like L.A., Chicago, New York, but Damn. I never got a chance to like. It, take it all in because yeah. I was always like oh I only had like an hour like what can I really do in an hour you know yeah so like those kind of things like I regretted so now when I started doing Japan more like Did I made it a point yeah I just gotta yes. explore you know like take it all in because man like there's so much in this world that we don't get to see that we just see like on TV, like, TV yeah. or pictures but like if you get a chance to be there you gotta take advantage of it so, yep I made so- a conscious effort too to take it in, take it in, man. Hell yeah! So you're doing jujitsu there too? Yeah. Or judo, judo? Jujitsu. Jujitsu. Not that good, but it's tough. <laughs> and then this guy's grabbing my, grabbing my shirt. What the hell? <laughs> so it's a little bit difficult, but it's fun. We have some like sneaky moves on them too, huh? Yeah. <laughs> like you didn't see that one, did you? <laughs> you do no gi too sometimes, or? Yeah, but there's more gi in Japan, so. 
And then the last time I was here in, in Guam, I went down to uh, uh, Steel Athletics. Shout out to them because they yeah. hooked me up for like a couple, couple oh, days. Oh, that's cool. Nice. Uh, I trained with uh, Mikey Joel. Did you too? Yeah. Beat me up pretty good. So <laughs> shout out to Mike. Thank you. Do you know Jerry Masa? <laughs> He stays in Japan. I'm bad with names, man. Yeah, he has a jiu-jitsu uh, club there, I think. Also. Oh. Well, I gotta go check it out then. Yeah. Give me details after, please. I will. <laughs> oh, my goodness gracious. Do you have a car in Japan? Mm, yes and yes. You can. Yeah. So you drive around there? Yeah. It's all well, there. Not, not all over. Not in Tokyo. Like, we're in Fukuoka where I stay. Mm. I gotta drive down there. It's a little bit weird sometimes, like driving on the opposite side, and like the streets are the streets. <laughs> Until are, now, you've been there for a while, right? Yeah, but it's, just, it's still weird because yeah. like if I go back and forth, then I oh, come back, yeah. come yeah. back here. I'm like, okay, I gotta drive on the other side, and then when I yeah, go back to Japan, is... I'm like, oh my god, back on the other side. What are you driving? That's crazy. Um, an Audi. Oh Hell yeah. yeah! Oh, right handle, right? Yeah. Oh shit! A, oh no, no, left, left. Oh, the American, oh. American stuff. Oh, oh, you have American shit. style oh, car in the... Yeah, yeah, the, it's on the left side. Oh, shit. But then I also I also drive a uh, what? Volkswagen. What model? Or not Volkswagen. Volkswagen? Um, I don't know. The expensive one. It's not mine, though. It's my friend's. She, I drive her car. But then she also has a, a Volkswagen thing. VW or whatever it's called. Yeah, yeah. yeah but yeah. that one, the steering wheel is on the right-hand side. And that's trippy. <laughs> I was like, oh, like, if I'm going to hit something, it's going to be a person. I'm sorry. Because you're always going back and forth. Yeah. Jap Japan. Yeah, safe, but Japan I, I, did, I do Japan more. Like, last year, I was like, maybe 10 months out of the year, I was in Japan. Mm -hmm. And then two months, I was in... Was States. there any breaks in between, or that's just yeah? No, it was, no, no, it wasn't. It wasn't. It was like I was there for like three months, and I get like two oh, weeks. Okay, okay. Then two months, and then one week, and then but it just added up to like pretty much like 80, 80 20. So, damn. Like the yakuza, you come across that or hear about that? Yeah, or? I've I've seen it. Um, but you've there, seen yeah. So like I did a show one time. Uh, I can't. It was in to somewhere in Tokyo, like a little on the outskirts of Tokyo, and our and like one of our uh, office staff was like, S "Don't mess with the people in this row, the, f the front row on this side." And I was like, "Oh," and I didn't know why. But then when I went out there, like everybody was in suits, and I was like, "Oh, throw it." That's oh. why. But you for the most, right away. Yeah, yeah. But I mean, for the most part, like it's it's not as bad as people think. Like they don't. Like they're not trying to like mess with people, you know. Like they just they just kind of want to do their thing. So yeah, you, like, I just, as long as you don't mess with them, they don't. Yeah, they'll be fine. I just watched the uh, HBO uh, like uh, like it's a Japanese Vice. Mm. Um, so and it's uh, like the cop guys are like they work with the yakuza. Ah. Yeah, it's on HBO. Check okay. it out when you have time. I but will. do you even have time to watch TV? Yeah, I watch you Netflix, do? bro. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Netflix. Okay. Hey, Joe Koi is coming out with a yeah movie. a movie. Yeah, yeah, I saw. I saw. Yeah. I was at the mall today. Easter Sunday. I was at the mall and I saw it and it was like, hey, wow. But yeah, I watched his last one and I was like, I was kind of messed up because I was like, he was like, yeah, you know, like everybody has those Tupperware. Like me growing up, I had and I was, yeah. like, I was like either butter or Cool Whip. Yeah, and he was like, bro, I had that, that fucking brown one, right? Yeah, the, the country, yeah. the country crock. I was like, bro, I had that yeah, one. I dude. had the Cool Whip. Yep. It's like, my shit. mom likes to put fruit salad in that. Shit. Yeah, that's another one, right? <laughs> like, they bro. fucking bring it to the party with the fruit salad, right? Bro. And then when he talked about like the napkins, the mismatch, like the Subway, <laughs> McDonald's, I was like, <laughs> yeah, like, bro, yeah, that's yeah, kind of yeah. like, bro, that's kind of messed up because I had that. Mm -hmm. Like my mom would always be like, hey. Get the like, napkin. Yeah, get the napkin. Get the napkin. <laughs> I, was like, man, I was like so embarrassed. Or you split your like, She's like, get the napkin over there. Like, Dude, I was like so embarrassed. Like, Dude, that was a regular McDonald's thing. napkin. <laughs> Boom. But in your house, so always like, there's a spill. Like, oh, here. You yeah. Go, yeah. 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 No, plus you had it on the car too, right? Yeah. Right. right. In, the, in the glove compartment. Yeah. <laughs> like, whoa, it's loaded. Like, after dude, church, you fucking that's, have, dude. Some wow. people don't even know what we're fucking talking about, but that's or fucking... straws, too. Are you Filipinos out there? Yeah. You know what we're talking about. They know. 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 They
straws and napkins. Bro. Then I just oh. used to go like this with my sister. We'll just oh, and the it. <laughs> my mom gets that pissed. Yeah, oh. dude. Fuck, now we have to go back to get that, some more. That was before like the fucking we didn't have cell no games, phone right? yeah. and shit like that, dude. So for you people out there, were you listening to this podcast? Where's Guam? No, we're taking you on a nostalgia tour. Yep. Yeah. We're, we're going we're back to back our to we've known this guy twenty era. plus <laughs> years. When things were better. Yeah. Twenty plus years ago. Yeah. When the Peshmo was cool. <laughs> hey, did you go to the yeah. flea market or the barbecue sticks? No. It's actually tomorrow. There's a food truck right there. What, what you, what's your what, what, what's on your agenda for the rest of the time that you're here? Um, actually, tomorrow I gotta do an interview at KUAM. Oh dang! Yeah. Hell yeah! I hey, give I us the, just give us the. I didn't. I didn't. <laughs> but the thing is, like that this, guy. but the thing is, I didn't want to do an interview. I just. Yeah. So I messaged the. So hotty is gang. I messaged the. <laughs> I'm gonna give a cheap plug here, but I messaged the uh, Chris Barnett. Yeah, yeah. I messaged him. I was like, Hey, bro, did you retire? And he's like, Yeah, bro, I retired. I yeah. Like, I was like, I'm not, like. Dude, I wanted That's to go. That's just recent. Yeah, but I I wanted to like just go mess with him on the radio or whatever. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's like, ah, bro, I retired. I was like, ah, oh, <laughs> shit. But he's like, hey, hey, but I can get you KU. I was like, I don't really care about doing that. I just wanted to go mess with you on the <laughs> yeah. on the radio. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, but then like, yeah, so he hooked me up with that. So I got to go do that tomorrow. Nice. 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 Hey, just eat more food. Eat more <laughs> local food while I'm here. Yeah, nice. Yeah. Did you get any like pickled pickled stuff? Yeah, my, so actually my mom made some. Ooh. Mango, right? Uh No, no, she she oh. made um, the cucumber and Ooh. daiko, just kind of chopped it yeah. up and threw it in. I was like, oh, wow. But, you know, actually, now that it's today, I got to go to, like, the store and get the the mm. ones where it's, like, it's by the cashier. Yeah, the dollar. Yeah. 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 Dollar, yeah. dollar, yeah. one yeah. dollar, right? Or the, like... Like daikong and all that yeah. kind of stuff, but I don't know. Like, those like it's it's changed since I was young. Like you guys grew up in Dayton, right? Yeah. yeah so, yeah. like the day not was it Chamorro Mart? Yeah, Chamorro Mart. Yeah. But that's not there anymore. Yeah, yeah it's a uh, like UFC. The, yeah. So <laughs> that's not there anymore. Which kind of <laughs> Chamorro Mart? <laughs> that's where that's it was like, like long time There was ago. one right, place where buy condoms. Dude, no, I was kidding. <laughs> <laughs> There's that one place. Um, right by Santa Barbara. Church. The Irish tight to know. Yeah. Yeah. So I remember oh, yeah, yeah. we. I used to go there because my uncle lives in Iglesia Circle. So oh, okay. Whenever I go to his house to play with my my cousins, like we'd go over there, do like, oh, I want fifty cents, rock you, fifty cents. <laughs> yeah. yeah. But I don't. I, I don't know. Do they still sell that there? Or? I think they do. No, it's like prepack. Oh, well, some do, but some other places like weren't near my house. It's mm. like prepackaged by the dollar. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. So they just that's one dollar. Yeah. 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 Ah. Not the same then. Yeah. yeah. Dang. A lot of or the man. one at DMS too, right? That store. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> we'll play video games too, right? <laughs> Street but Fighter. sometimes, sometimes they would have the the trucks in the back of the DM. Yeah. Like, by yeah. The basketball court. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The fried rice and chili. Dude, they were so bro. yeah. Fried the Dude, fried rice chili. Back in like in those, in those days when they had like the like in the mornings, if you oh, go the there. The store. Dude, no. Um, where those? Yeah, yeah, they yeah. used to have this guy that sold like comic book cards and stuff. Was it? Oh, you ever, you ever did no, you collect the comic? Well, yeah, so he had this like little shop set up, like comic book cards or basketball cards or whatever. Like kind of next to like where like, they sold food, but then the guy yeah, was yeah. there selling cars. And so I was like, dude, this is dope. They don't do that. I don't, I don't think they do that anymore. No, not that stuff. a hustler, dude. Man, it's fun times, man. That was in the morning? Yeah, oh, before. shit, dude. Dude, DMS... That was the original food truck, but it was in a van. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> dude, those are <laughs> fucking right. That, they it got was that the rice late, cooker in yeah, there. Yeah, it was that lady right with the Chilean rice. Dude, that, dude, they used to. Oh, dude, dude that's right. it was good. Yeah. Chilean rice, right? That wasn't. That was a food van. And yeah, all she right had then. was just Tabasco yeah. and fucking what else? Tabasco. And then and they started sauce. selling the small Tabascos, and then people were like, "I could do this, right?" <laughs> Or about the little fucking seaweed, uh, what's that fucking bag with the s- sweet and sour with Tabasco? They used to sell that oh, shit. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. The plum that with the leaking thing, they put Tabasco in it. That Basco, right? <laughs> Jeff <laughs> Cobb in the house. Yeah, yeah. Thank you for coming. Da- Man, hey, thank you again oh, my for hitting us up. Appreciate hey, Jeff it. Cobb, professional wrestler. Yeah, check him out. Hey, guys. But most importantly, homie. Hell yeah. <laughs> Alumni. Man, I feel like I feel like our classmates are watching are gonna be watching this. Too. There's, a few, <laughs> like, there's a few. We got a hundred. We got a big sub, um, 
amount of subscribers at 148, but a lot of them are from our class. <laughs> That's fine. And they're, they're like, man, these fucking guys. Uh, you remember April Zapatis? Yeah. yeah. She's like, it's she just plays the first like, or the clips or whatever, and then she always messages like, is it just gonna be you two laughing the whole time? <laughs> Hey man. Fuck it, yeah. Hey, what's up, April? What's up, April? Yo, Probably. Zapatis. Yeah, congratulations. Yeah. Yep. Why, oh. why the congratulations? Your son's graduated. Yeah. Oh, congratulations. Yeah. yeah. Your, 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 your girl just graduated. Yeah. Damn. Yeah, I know, right? 2022. But, like, when you come back home, does, like, all your family members are like, Jeff! Yeah, I mean, uh, we don't. I don't really have a big family. Yeah, but I mean, have you been to? So, did you do a barbecue or a fiesta? Yeah, actually, or yeah, last night. Yeah, Hell barbecue. Yeah, it was dope. Yeah, just at the house, like my mom, my brother, my cousin came over. So I was like, yeah, it's pretty cool. Nice. It was dope, man. So yeah, it's it's <laughs> different. Like barbecue is different here than. Oh yeah. Like especially like mainland. Yeah. Like, nah. In Vegas, there's a spot called Red Rice. Yeah. They oh, how is that? Good. Not I bad. always see yeah. everyone fucking taking it's pictures. It's not bad. Right it's not bad. How's the Kelligan's good? Yeah, I mean, but it's just something about eating it here. Yeah, is different than the mainland. Have, no matter have. how much you like, you can cook it. It's, I don't know. It it, it's tastes, not exact. It tastes better here. You probably always, need that tongue and always, tongue and wood. Always at home. Yeah. Tongue and tongue and yeah. wood, maybe. Yeah. Dang. <laughs> fucking the cardinal. Huh? I want cardamom. some Kelligan. Huh? Is, how's that? Um, oh, it's not bad. The, this one, Jack Daniels. Yeah, it's pretty good. Yeah, so I didn't know. I was like, "Fuck, I don't drink whiskey." That's why I, they're all like pretty much full. Oh. And then someone gave me that one too. Oh well. Whoever. Actually, all of these whiskeys was given to me, but I don't drink whiskey. I just drink rum and coke. Oh, okay, well, thank you, whoever gave. Yeah, thanks. Um, yeah, you're making me look bad. I don't remember who gave that to me. <laughs> or you can you can edit after. Yeah, if you remember the name, like yeah. thanks. I uh, know I'm definitely fuck. gonna edit when the glass <laughs> broke in my fucking hand. Dude, that was, Dude, that was pretty cool. What the fuck? It broke like like it's like perfect, perfect yeah. right here. So tomorrow, check this out. Tomorrow at work, I'll be like the guy that washed it. I'll be like, you fucking set me up, right? What'd you do? <laughs> You knew I was doing a podcast. Yeah, yeah, dude. He's gonna be like, no boss. I'll be like, fuck you, dude. Hey. I have it on camera. You, know you gotta do yeah. is, hey, clock it. <laughs> <laughs> fuck him, dude. My ho- I smoke with my uh, fucking work workers, dude. <laughs> That's cool. For a while, when I was growing, every time I harvest, they're my. I'm like, hey man, try my stuff out. Because once they said you can grow in the house, I start growing. Mm-hmm. But they That's like. The social, uh, like, uh, networks, they fucking sometimes shadow ban you. Oh. Or, or, like, they just cut out the whatever picture you're putting up. So then, I still smoke, but I don't show it on social media. Yeah, it's, it's a weird, it's a weird slope for that one. Mm-hmm. It's like, not all states and territories yeah. have it, are legal, but... It's weird. It's like Hawaii. It's technically Dude, they, not legal. They, no, Hawaii but it's like likes Hawaii is like it. the number one. Really? Number one weed state, and I would assume. It's weed everywhere there. Yeah, bro. Shit. When I was going they to college in Missouri, when I was going to college in Missouri, my buddy from Hawaii had it sent from Hawaii <laughs> to Missouri <laughs> because the Missouri weed sucked. Uh, really? So you guys had the imports? Yeah. Wow. The Hawaii, the Hawaii weed was by far more dominant than the Missouri weed. What's your thoughts on... Wow. Uh, it's crazy. This is totally off the subject or another subject, but BJ Penn going for governor. Um, I don't know. I, I haven't heard his... Po- I'm not for voting for someone just because they're popular. Yeah. Like, I prefer, I prefer to hear what they stand by. Because like everybody's talking about like the Rock's gonna run for president, which no. is cool. Have you watched his Young Rock show? No, but that's yeah. But that's pretty he, much what yeah. He, yeah he, but like I don't mind it, but I don't know what his intentions. This, what yeah, like what's his stance on things? Like because it's cool. Because like, I mean, shit, this is what happened with Donald Trump. Like nobody really knew what his political stance was. He was just popular. Like, it, but people, I felt like he made good deals though. I, I, that I, means I, there's I, pros and cons with yeah. it. Like nobody, no president is perfect. No, never. you're, you're going to have haters 
That's, anyway, the, that's yeah. the crazy thing Except about for Clinton. <laughs> no. Because <laughs> he goes, but I didn't inhale. Yeah. But like, I feel Dude, like... you're like, liar. liar. You but he, he, was, he was getting a BJ too, so... Dude. You know, yeah. Dude, Dude fucking, fucking Clinton. Clinton. So like, th- yeah, those kind of things, I feel like it's Just like... Listening to the Beatles. You're, it's a lose-lose situation. Like, you yeah. can't... Like, if you're a Republican, the Democrats are going to hate yeah. you. If you're a Democrat, you can't Republican make hate you. everybody happy. Yeah, you can't. So, like, the best you can do is just have what you what you stand by and what you're going to do. Yeah. Or what you want to do. And But I don't know what The Rock or BJ Penn wants so to do. have you met Jesse the Body Ventura before? I have not. Yeah, but yeah. anyways, what's up, guys? Ba, 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 Special hey. guest in the house. Where's Guam oh, Podcast? What up? Jeff Cobb in the house. Professional wrestler. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Been around the world. But more importantly... Class of 2000, JFK. Yeah, I love that. Dad, homie, I just, homie. I just dated ourselves. Huh? Just, hey, sorry. That's cool, man. Class of, hey, this guy's double time champ. Class of 2010. <laughs> <laughs> Kidding. Hey. 2000. 2000, man. It's crazy to see, like, different people's lives from our class that are not on WAM anymore. Mm-hmm. Like, and you're a fucking wrestler, champion. and But when you came back and we're just chilling right now, it feels like... Regular shit? Yeah. yeah. Dude, Jeff Cobb in the house. Oh, yeah. And we have to thank Mark Zuckerberg for that. Yeah. <laughs> thank Dude, you, we man. didn't have that kind of technology. Our yeah. earliest one was Guam Chat, right? And Bro, you know, Messenger. That, the one where you had to, like, call them and then say <laughs> what your message is, and then they'll send it to your pager. It's just a pager. <laughs> Dude, I remember that. Yeah. Dude, they oh, will never know that that's technology. That's a beep. First is a beeper. These guys yeah. don't know that technology. Do you guys know what pager talk is? No, no you don't. Yeah. Well, oh, the class of two thousand probably does. Yeah. But dude, that was oh some crazy times. Who they you, you fucking like write text, the whole message in the you numbers? Like to text yeah. your chick, right? Like, one four three. Bro. One four three. Those dude. were the days. <laughs> Pagers, they don't even know. Dude, that's I'm, one of those videos where they're like show the kids the like tech from back in the day. So like you just give them a page and you're like, what go ahead and use this, and they'll be like, what? Yeah, yeah. Or VCR. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. You having a good time though? I'm having a great time, man. It's yeah. good to catch up with people, man. Like especially, I mean, social media is one thing. Like yeah. you see everybody, what's everybody's doing, but like to actually have a conversation, Chill it's cool, them. man. Yeah. It's cool. Yeah. It's cool to just like catch up and like even if it's only like what I got here, what a little bit after eight, and then. You're gonna leave before ten, so it's what two hours. Yeah. Even if it's just two hours, that's still cool. Hell just to yeah. be like, hey man, what's up? Like what's the clubs in Japan, sorry. Um, I haven't gone in a while, just because I don't really. I'm not really. A, I mean, a little bit older, but uh, I'm just, like that's just not my scene anymore. I, just, I prefer bars, just yeah. to chill and just drink and just talk. Yeah, but yeah, I've yeah. been to a few clubs. Like, um, there's a famous area in Tokyo called Rapungi. That's the crazy. <laughs> that's like the crazy area. Like you got a lot of. I mean, I don't want to sound like I'm being racist or singling anybody out, but you got a lot of Nigerian guys there, and they're just like, "Hey, you like girls? You like girls?" Like, oh. <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah. It's you like, want to see a cartwheel? Like, like, come, 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 come to. They they try to bring you to the club, and then like the one time, like I remember the one time specifically, like probably the first, not the first time, but like one of the times that I went, like they bring you to the club, but then there's all like a lot of Russian strippers or whatever, and they they try to rip you off, like they charge you more oh, like wow. the one time like we all ordered like there was like six or seven of us and then we all only ordered one drink and the bill was like twelve hundred dollars whoa what? one what drink? drink no like there was like seven of us so seven drinks for like twelve hundred dollars like Holy like what is this and like, oh crazy. no you bought like four drinks each and like no we didn't yeah so we just like sitting there arguing with these guys and they're just like no 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 it's like like you know what you pay this or they try call- to, yeah they, they try, try to-, to get you guys like yeah. that yeah and there's like you know what that's dirty it's like you pay this or we're gonna call the cops and we're like yeah call the cops then yeah and they but they obviously don't want the cops to come so they end up just 300 bucks get the fuck out of there because if you're a tourist they try to get you yeah so like i mean there's a lot of military guys yeah like military people out there so they they try to get away with that yeah holy shit they're bringing one of the military that i think the seal base from wherever and that's why they're rebuilt they're marine marines right no, I don't know. Yeah, seals are marines, right? Marines are seals. No, whatever. But sorry, no, seals are no, navy. No, no offense, but they're bringing one of the bases from over there all up to Guam. Really? Yeah, and rebuilding the and uh, in like Nick Nick Tams uh, or 
Oh, no okay. NCS. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They fucking cleared that whole back to just like the base. Really? Yeah. Yeah, you'll see it if you pass that way. It's crazy. I don't yeah. think you'll pass that way, but it's crazy. Yeah. They're taking that whole base from wherever in Japan and bringing it here because their lease ran out in Japan. Oh okay. Uh, I think NCS used to be like a navy, one, right? There's a base there. Dude, no, but you, I think it was navy. Or or navy. Oh, I'm not sure. I don't know. Sure. This is a long time ago. Yeah. Closed down too, right? That's how that one housing area is not, it's uh they closed it down. I don't know. And Nick Tams. <clears throat> oh, is that they, I mean that'd be I mean, if it brings more money into our economy, that'd be cool. Yeah, but like yeah. the politicians are like they're Four. gonna break everything. Well you just charge them more. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, you, you dude. break you buy. You break you, you, break, buy. you buy. Yeah, you break you buy like that one. You baby. having a good time since you've been back? Hell yeah. It's good to be back, man. It's just like it sucks, like with this pandemic, man. Like it was rough. I mean, I'm sure it's rough for everybody. Yeah. But it's just like you know, you can't travel, can't like I didn't see my mom since 2019. So it was it nice when you guys saw yeah, each was, other? Yeah. And, yeah. It's cool, man. Like you know, you haven't seen your mom in like three years. It's, yeah. It's just good to see her fam- family, friends. Have you brought her to Japan? No, she's she's been in Japan before though. Like okay. Like wow, really, really young. Mm. You sure uh, Jeff came for any reason? Not recently. The last time I saw it was when my brother graduated in like 2012 or something. I was like, whoa, bro. JFK's brand new. Yeah. (laughs) But whoever the principal is now, I'm going to come calling like in the next year about maybe doing a show at JFK. Hell yeah. Former alumni. Hey, our intramural teacher is still there. Lod? Yeah. This is my Facebook friend, bro. <laughs> yeah, me too. Is Lod watch this? Make sure you, when you post it, yeah. tag, hey, him, tag him. Hey, Lod, what's up? Man, no, you didn't retire yet, bro. Dude. Hey, dude, when that I was fucking... still looks the same. I know. Hey, when I, when, when I would fucking go clubbing, like when we were a little bit older, or maybe even in high school, that fucking yeah. guy was in the yeah. club with dude, him. Dude, his whole crew. Yeah. Um, who's that math, uh, the math teacher? Mesa? No, 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 no. He was uh, Mala, Malasa, no. Manasala? No, Manasala was our, 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 our intramural teacher. That's him. Yeah, Manasala. Lod. No, yeah, no, 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 not Malasala. Um, shit, he taught geometry. I don't know. But him, like, they were, you remember um, during intramurals, they yeah. were the intra uh, unstaffables? <laughs> That sounds, Mr. Hey, that sounds Mr. G. Yeah, so all those guys. Mr. G, remember they're Mr. All, G? They're all cool with each other. Yeah. I, I always picture them at the clubs. Like yeah. all those guys just hanging out together. Mr. G, dude. No, what Mr. Cool. G, do? Like, <laughs> fucking, and my, I got stoned the fucking first day. And then I got stoned the second day. The second day, he, like, people were reading a book or whatever. And then they go, Stuart. And I was already tripping, like, right? <laughs> and I go, huh? And then fuck it, I just pulled the book and then someone right next to me goes, and then fucking like where it's at. So I started reading it and then he goes, what the fuck are you doing? She told me the wrong part to read. Wait, Wait, do you remember who it was? I forgot, dude. But when we left the class, like everyone was like, he goes, Stuart, I want to talk to you. So I'm at the end and he goes, he fucking just goes straight up. Don't ever come to my class stoned again. And I was like, fuck. Yes, sir. Yeah. Yeah. So I never went to that class stoned again. That was Jerry. Huh? That no, was... he wasn't my classmate in that class. What, what, what class is that when he told you the wrong stuff? I don't know. People always tell me the wrong stuff. It's like that fucking millionaire dog. The They write the wrong answer on the mirror. Yeah. yeah they always do that to me in class yeah, before. It's okay, man. Yeah. All that matters is you graduate. <laughs> I was a year-round student, though. Oh, awesome. Every summer school I was in, fucking. Uh, yeah. I, I did one summer school, and I like, told myself, never again. The year that I did summer school, I had to take uh, History of Guam. And that was a, that year. Do you remember that plane crash? Yeah, oh, yeah the, the yeah. Korean one. I was at in class, and our I forgot the teacher's name. But uh, her mom was a teacher at the school, and she was a teacher as well. But... She was like, she heard it on the news, and then we looked out and you could see the smoke and stuff. That's oh, crazy. Man. Was this at JFK? Yeah, yeah. Summer oh, school at JFK. I was uh, also um, crazy. a waiter for Palace Hotel. It's a different name now. Oh, but not, in our time, it's, it's Palace, Palace Hotel. 
it changed the Sheraton after, and oh, now okay. it's something else. Mm. But Palace Hotel, you remember that one, right? Yeah. <laughs> so, so I was a fucking waiter there for like two or three years. So those people that the families that was in that crash, they they were able to come back to like because they buried them here. Mm. They would be all the families come and fucking just uh, do their thing for like two or three weeks, government paid, and they stayed at Palace Hotel. And I was fucking like, the wait staff there was Iron Man style. Like they, we didn't go home. We stayed in the hotel. Oh. We fucking pound, 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 and then we served them breakfast, lunch, and dinner, and then fucking party the night, and then do it again. And we did that shit for like, it, they're like three weeks straight, and it's all paid by the whatever that flight was. Or whatever the airline. Yeah, yeah. the airline was. That's crazy. Yeah, I mean, it sucks. But man. you slept there. Right? We just stayed in the hotel. All, all of us have, like, you order whatever you want, and then you fucking... Um, because you're on call for them, right? You're already on premise. Yeah. Yeah, it was a rough fucking shift, though. I mean, it sucks for that, that reason to be there, you know? Yeah, that too. But, boy, let me tell you about the kimchi. Like, they had a chef, but he was in a Korean chef, mm. and he ran out of kimchi on the first day. Bro. Dude, he was so in trouble, but... They eat kimchi at every meal. Right. It's, good it's at every fucking, run, like, run, breakfast, lunch, dinner. You're on the pay less, bro. <laughs> dude, dude they, it was crazy, bro. You know who else had their parties at shirt, at a Palace Hotel all the time? His birthday party and all the waiters, wait staff, everybody made hella hell of money. Was fucking uh, Guterres' uh, birthday. Governor? Oh, yeah. Governor so Carlos. he would always have his birthday there. Damn. And this party is crazy, bro. It's like the most packed party you've ever seen. And it's like... Bro, I still have that t-shirt, man. The 1998. still the one. Do <laughs> <laughs> you rock it once in a while? No, I actually don't have it anymore. But I had that one for a while. The yellow one. What, Bring yeah. Back the Sunshine? No, I don't know. It's like the yellow... Dude, that guy can speak good fucking Tagalog, bro. Like really? his last campaign. Like he's fucking at the Filipino party and just speaking Tagalog. I was like, this guy's better than me. <laughs> Yeah, dude. Dang, bro. Hey, but shout out to, uh, what's his son-in-law's name? Rich. 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 Rich we bro. miss you. His son-in-law, is he uh, plays drums, mm. and he was with us in the clubs at Kento's. So, like, every 30, 30 minutes or an hour, it changes. Band, DJ, mm. band, DJ. The drummer was our homie. Uh, yeah. Oh, yeah. You say, like, you said, like, undercover battles. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Like, nah, bro. DJs are better. <laughs> but you know what? It's all about the music and you know, people are having a good time. It's all oh, about yeah, it. Yeah. yeah. It was fun, man. I mean, can't help it if they're having more fun with the DJs. <laughs> <laughs> gotcha. Got it. That's, they always have more fun than the DJs because when you're partying, you're just partying. Yeah. When everyone's done partying, that's when we're packing our shit up. Yeah, dude. <laughs> it's like, fuck! I gotta bring this shit all home and everything. So many junks I've seen, so many fucking... I don't know. But being DJ is cool, though. The, he was in DJ Club. Oh, yeah. And then I... Just carrying And this guy opened the door and I go, all full. <laughs> no <That's>... space. <laughs> <laughs> I was a big classroom. We had space. I'm sorry. Yeah, no, but I... After I DJ for a while, I taught him, and he was like just trying to go wild, you know, and do whatever he wants. I was like, "Why the fuck are you doing that?" Then I went to Washington for a while. He was in Cali, was DJing there, and then when he came back here, he was DJing for. Didn't we go to play pool one time? Yeah, in Seattle. Seattle. Oh, dude. Okay, I remember that yeah. now. I was like, "No, you see, we we met you in Washington two times." Okay. Yeah. One time we just picked you up and dropped you to the bar. Yeah, and then one time we played pool. Yeah. I remember that. I was like, he hit me up too. Was that MySpace? <laughs> dude, that was, oh my God, that was, was that MySpace. Was that MySpace? Yeah. Dude, that was a MySpace. And then uh, I think your profile pic was you with the Guam flag, right? Yeah. yeah dude. Dude, we just aged ourselves again. Dope. We're going to be like these fucking oldies. I know, bro. You remember? Now, you're, now you're going to start bringing up like people from Guam. <laughs> That's a good one. Dude. Oh, yeah. People from Guam. Holy shit. People. But they're going to fucking search it and they won't find anything, though, because it was still low tech that time. Right? <laughs> still in Talaza 2000. Talaza 2000. <laughs> that was the internet Remember before. The dial? Yeah. <laughs> Yo, 
you're like, shit. Do you remember those Apple computers? It was big, but they had like different colors. Yeah, bro. Yeah. I had an orange laptop. Ooh. A thick one. <laughs> thick one. Can knock us that down. shit will fucking last through war. Bro. You ever met Mike Tyson? No. Oh, he lives in Vegas, though, but I've never seen him. Who, like, did, when you were in Vegas, did you meet any stars and were you starstruck? Mm. Or they're like, hey, what's up, Jeff? Not really. I mean, there's a few people like I met at random shows like that were watching like a... Like, you guys don't know this. Like, you remember Topanga? Yeah. yeah. Hey, was, yeah. You, you remember was, Topanga? Was that, hey, everybody Boy remember. Yeah. Was that yeah. Boy Meets World? Yeah. No, but like Topanga comes there and was like, ooh, Topanga. Yeah, no, we're yeah. all like, oh, oh. Yeah. at least some of, some of the older people are like, oh, dude, that's Topanga. Yeah. yeah. They don't know Topanga. So Topanga. Like, um, that's a good one. The girl, the girl that played Matilda. Oh, okay. Yeah, she was at one of our shows. Got a picture of her. It's cool. Yeah, it's like cool yeah. people, man. Oh, but you said you rolled with Sakuraba, right? Or no, 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 no. Uh, he's he wrestles in Japan oh, like for okay, a different bad, company. For a different company. Are you still wrestling now? He no. still is. Yeah. Oh wow. Yeah, he works for another a rival, not a rival company, but just a different company. Oh, but you met him then, or something? Yeah, yeah, I met him a few times. No, but when that guy was fucking That's stomping the greasies, yeah, the greasy killer, bro. they they, they nicked him. They nicknamed him the Gracie. That's crazy. That was Gracie Dude, yeah. yeah. Woo. Pop Henzel's arm. He fucking took out more than one. Uh, Sakuraba was ruling that time. He beat a couple of them. I think he beat four of them. He's man yeah. bro. What's your... Um, so, you've been everywhere. What's your favorite spot? Like, time to relax, do what you want to do. What's your, your go-to? Japan, Japan? Japan, yeah. I mean, if you take that away... Because uh, you've been to all the states probably already. For wrestling, I've been to like... Like, almost 30. Holy probably. damn. For wrestling, but... Like, I've been to some for non-wrestling, like for... Vacation. Like, in college and stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But, yeah, for wrestling, by 30, 30 something. Maybe 30 states. Yeah. Do you host clinics, too? For... Eh, so I try not to. You don't but, like that shit? Yeah. Fuck but that then, shit. And then countries, <laughs> maybe like 20 countries for wrestling. Damn, so, yo. Yeah. I don't know. I mean, I, like Japan's like my, one of my favorites. 20 countries you've been to? Yeah. That's fucking 20. crazy, bro. Like 15 to 20. This that motherfucker's okay. been around. Hell yeah. Fucking Jeff Cobb in the house. Thank like, you for coming now. My yeah. pleasure, man. Hey, thank you guys for watching. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Where's Guam Podcast? Special guest in the house, Jeff. Cobb. Thanks for watching. We're going to put his links and the stuff that he talks about in the fucking description. Yeah, so check yeah. it out. Jeff Cobb in the house. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What do you want to say to the fucking guys? Dude, know. it's cool to be back, man. Thank you, Stu. Thank you, Amir, for, yeah. Yeah, yeah. for having us on yeah. Where's Guam. But you know what? Where's Guam? Here's Special Guam. guest. Shoot, guys. Shoot.